After a tough two games on the road, the Sounders return to the friendly confines of Century and Link Field as they host the Colorado Rapids on Saturday. The team learned some good news and bad news this week as Ozzie Alonso's red card was rescinded, but they will be losing Eddie Johnson, who has recently called up to the U.S. national team. No, I'm very happy, you know, for the team up here, the, the red card, and I'm back in the, to the field. Always happy to, to win the field, to play, to do the best for the team. And like I say, I'm very happy to to give everything for, for, for my team. It's the most difficult situation we've been in injury-wise and, uh, you know, with people coming in and out with call-ups and so forth. But uh, it is what it is, and now we got to figure out a way to, to still be successful even with the obstacles that are set in front of us. Along with losing Johnson, the team will also be missing Michael Sperning and possibly others due to injury, forcing Ziggy to rely on the services of goalkeeper Andrew Weber, who was added to the Sounders roster just over a week ago. Andrew's been here before, so he knows a lot of the guys, and uh, you know he's trained well, and uh, he's the guy who's going. So you know he's we're trying to put him in situations where he's behind those guys in goal. We'll do it again tomorrow, and and hopefully communication will, will be there. You know it's it's, it's going to take. Uh, more talk because the instincts aren't going to be there because he's a new he's a new you know person again. I know all four of them, so that's good. Uh, DeAndre's only the new one, but uh, we got along pretty well in the first game, so they're starting to respond to me um, throughout practice, and it, it, I feel pretty good. Weber and the rest of the Sounders' back five will have their hands full with Colorado, a team who's coming off a midweek win against New England and have not lost in their last four MLS matches. The Sounders, however, will look to break that streak while extending one of their own, as a win Saturday would mark the eighth straight win over the Rapids, setting a new league record for most consecutive wins over one team. Ziggy always says, you know, it's always good to be the first team to do something. You know, that's something that he's always said every time I'm here. I've heard him say that, and every time, you know, we happen to do it here and there. So this is another time that we can be the first to you know, beat a team eight times in a row. I know they're, they know that as well. I'm sure they've heard it. So, you know, they don't want that on the opposite side of that. So they're in, they're doing well right now. So it'll be a good game. Colorado's uh, an improved team over last year. They play a little bit of a different style uh, that in terms of how they played last year. They rely a lot more on uh, on their physical uh, side of the game, you know, with Atiba Harris and, you know, the speed of Deshaun Brown. And then they have uh, Edson Buttle who brings some size onto the field as well, you know, on set pieces. Then they bring Drew Moore forward and O'Neal forward. And, you know, so they got a bunch of a bunch of big bodies to take advantage of. So they've uh, uh, they still want to possess the ball and knock the ball a little bit, you know, more than Colorado teams in the past going back about three years. But they're not so possession orientated as they were last year. Uh, and they're definitely a little more direct and a little more relying on their physical attributes. The Sounders will try and make history on Saturday as they'll be going for their fifth straight win here at CenturyLink Field. Just a reminder, kickoff has been moved up to 1 p.m. You can watch it live on Kong with Ross Fletcher and Taylor Graham calling all the action, or you can listen to it live on 97.3 Cairo FM. I'm Jackie Montgomery for SoundersFC.com. Give your full 90 with the Sounders FC mobile app featuring live audio, match day blog and much more to keep you connected. Download your app at soundersfc.com mobile.